One David one or one Tango one? It's actually one David one. Apologize, dispatch. Copy one David one. I also need you to uh, go on dude. I'm not showing you on the GPS. What is up, everybody? This is Zipoy55957 signing in, and we are back with some Elevation Spring role play. We're going to be using my boy, Deputy Paul White. We're going to be in this 2021 or maybe a 2022 uh, unmarked FBI Tahoe. You know what I'm saying? We're just going to be using a lot, utilizing this vehicle just for a brief moment. Uh, we're probably going to switch to a mark unit here in a minute. But as you probably already heard, me and my boy Proverbs Gaming has already started off uh, on some things. So, you know, um, we're going to kind of continue that a little bit. And then uh, we'll probably switch our vehicles and get it set up with the grappler and all that good stuff that we're supposed to have. Um, make sure y'all follow my boy Proverbs Gaming. He makes some awesome content. You all will love it. So make sure y'all go check him out on that. And... Let's make sure we got all our lighting set up so we don't see that uh, contrast issues there, like so. Oh, wow. What an accident. Um, so make sure I follow my boy Proverbs Gaming right there. All right. And let's uh, get off into this thing and put our seatbelt on. He just pulled me over. He said I was speeding without my lights on and all that stuff, so... Okay. They uh literally turn oh, okay. One tango one. Gonna be out on the 1011 with a uh, four door vehicle, blue in color, occupied one time. Store me a mark unit. My way is gonna be West Joshua 255. So he literally just hit that guy. Yeah, it's four door. Hello, sir. How you doing? All right. Deputy Paul White with the uh, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. The reason that I'm stopping you right now is because you literally hit that guy right there. And you didn't uh, you didn't even stop to see if he was okay, okay? So that's the reason that uh, you are being stopped at this uh, moment. All right? So at this time, I do need to see uh, your driver's license, proof of insurance, and registration. Okay. Let's see what we can get that off of him real quick. All right. Hmm. One day one on scene. Copy one day one on scene. what we got here. Hey, can you uh, check my uh, signal too? See if it froze. I'm gonna run his, uh, I don't have a computer to run his name, but his name is uh, Kerry Schaefer. Okay, no, you're still good on my end. Okay, sounds good. Probably was just my uh, mobile. Okay, sounds good. Probably just my uh, mobile. Sounds good. Right, uh, you want me to run his name? Yeah, it's uh, here. Let me uh, write it down for you. There, there you go. All right. I'll run it for you. Give me one second. All right. Appreciate it. 
Yeah, just hang tight, my man. My partner is gonna run the uh, your information. All right. Guess we could probably ask him a few questions while we're sitting here. Are there any drugs or illegal substance in the vehicle? No, there aren't. Uh, this is your vehicle. No, it's a rental. Okay, but we are. Do you have a valid driver's license? I'd rather not answer. Okay. Have you ever been convicted of a felony? No, I haven't. All right. Just asking some questions while we uh, wait on him to run it. Uh, the 27 and 29 uh, on the subject. You can send it to the vehicle, sir. Yes, go ahead. All right. Let's see what you got. Yes, sir. This may not be good for him. Okay, can you run the uh, 28 on it? Because he's stating that it's a rental. I right, appreciate it. I'm gonna go ahead and 1015 him anyway because he did uh, do a hit and run. He hit a pedestrian back there. I didn't even stop. That was the reason I was pulling him over. All right. Yeah, go ahead. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and get him out of the vehicle. All right, Mr. Schaefer, go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, please. Again. All right. Well, at this time, sir, you'll be placed under arrest for uh, the uh, hit and run and also driving on the suspended license, okay? You got the right to remain silent. Anything you say can't be used against you in the court of law. Okay, we're going to add assault uh, threatening a uh, peace officer uh, with those charges, okay? So, uh, at this time, you got the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in the court of law. You got the right to have an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, the one will be provided to you at no additional cost. Do you understand your rights as I read them to you? All right. With your rights in mind, do you wish to speak further to me? Okay. We'll go ahead and do all the, the good stuff. We'll get uh get a transport unit out here for them. One take one. Can you store me a 32 for PT and also a 51 in my location? Copy, thank you. All right, let's uh, search the vehicle now. Meth pipe in the back seat, loaded nine millimeter under the seat. All right. All right, so here's the charges, okay? I did find a loaded uh, nine millimeter under your uh, seat. So you're gonna be charged with a deadly weapon. You're gonna be charged with the meth that I found in the vehicle. Uh, hit and run, and also you're going to be charged with the uh, uh, driving on a suspended license. All right, let me move my vehicle so I don't get killed or my vehicle don't get hit. They are some idiots. All right, so... Uh so the yeah, vehicle that, indeed, it may okay. be rented. Okay. It may be rented. It's, just, it's not in this name. It's somebody else's name. What's his uh, last name? It's Powell. Elba Powell. Okay. What's the name? So it could be a rental. It could have been a family member. Um, it's not reported stolen or anything like that. So. Yeah, I found a weapon underneath the uh, driver's seat. And then it was a loader, uh, nine millimeter. Then it was some meth in the vehicle. So we're gonna get this down to uh, Sandy for processing and get that evidence. And then, uh, like I said, the hit and run is what I was charging with off the rip. And then the, uh, but you know, the driving on the suspended license. You get a citation for that, but. All right, well, I appreciate it. Um, Look like the uh, this operation may be concluding here soon, so I might be switching to a marked vehicle. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Yeah, no worries, man. I'll be in the area uh, if you need anything. 
All right. Well, I appreciate you, Lieutenant. You be safe out here, Sorry. man. All right, you too. Sorry about earlier. Oh, no worries. Yeah, we still got that 55. So we catch up to it. Oh, wow. That's not even the fullest complete stop. Go ahead and get him stopped here. Got to do better than that. One take on one track. One take on one track. Gonna be Northwest 279 Panorama, Panorama, Panorama Drive on a dark and color four door van occupied two times. Store me a 32 code one. All right, let's see. I suppose I had 10 four show you out on 10 and 11. You're requesting a 32. Can you re reaffirm that postal? Uh, yeah. Uh, yes, it's going to be a 279. 279. All right, advice code. Code one. All right, tempo. I'm going to go ahead and run the plate. Let's get proactive here. Let's get things moving along real quick. Get it moving along. Uh, let's see. And the plate is as follows. O U. Okay. O Q G nine oh five. We got German Rodriguez. All right. Everything's clean, clear there. All right. All right, this uh, watch my six. I got him for uh, speeding doing a uh, 52, then I got him again at 55 and a 45. So that's going to be the reason. Oh, okay, so uh, I got him for speeding. Um, he was doing 55 and a 45, so that's going to be the reason for the stop. Yeah, okay, that's fine. All right. Hello, sir, how you doing? Uh, Deputy Paul White, well, Deputy White with the uh, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. The reason for the stop is because I clocked you first going 52 to 45, and then as I got closer up on you, uh, you were going 55 into 45, all right? So at this time, we're going to ask you to drive like people for showing the registration. I understand you're a little nervous and sweaty, but, you know, police interaction sometimes do that to folks. Now, let's get this information real quick. All right, hang tight uh, real quick for me, all right? Is there a reason that you're nervous and uh, sweaty, though? You got anything illegal in the vehicle that needs to be made aware of? Let's ask some questions, man. Uh, let's see. Parking violation. Uh, are you currently under the influence of any kind? I took medication. All right. All right, just hang tight. All right. I guess at this point, uh, we can just give him a citation for the uh, speed. When you do it enough, you kind of get it. So he's in the 10 miles an hour zone, so 234 bucks. And that's what we're going to make it. 234, we're going to give him, uh, we'll give him three points on it because he did increase his speed by three additional miles. Let's go ahead and get that printed up for Dispatch him. calling one tag on one, one David, one 77. Copy dispatch. Uh, one tag of one is 77. Uh, so I seen code for. 10 4 show all units under control. 1144. All right. 
be good boy. All right, now we're gonna read them in week. All right, Mr. Rodriguez, you're gonna be looking at a $234 citation, all right, for the speed. You are gonna be getting the, uh, three points on your license, okay? I need you to slow it down, man. I need you to sign on the back of the citation, not to miss the gifts that you're gonna pay the fine in period court. All right. Hey, partner, you wanna uh, run that passenger's information? Uh, yeah, right, sure. And here's the license back as well, sir. I appreciate it. So he seemed a little nervous, but we don't have much to uh, really investigate further unless he give us a reason to do so. Uh, he's valid. Okay. All right, but the driver seemed a little nervous and sweaty, but I ain't really smell anything, so I'm just gonna go ahead and let him go with the citation. Okay. I wish we could do more, but this is where we at. All right, sir, uh, at this time you are free to go, okay? Just slow it down, man. One tango one. One take on one. You can show me a uh, 10 8 one citation. Hey, uh, Deputy White. Deputy White. E I don't know if I want to talk to you right now, boy. Uh, what's up? Uh, you can't be driving that vehicle. God damn it, I knew it. I knew vehicle. it. You need to go get another vehicle. I, I like this vehicle, though. It's a good vehicle. It's a nice vehicle. And well, it's I'm qualified. Nope, it's yeah. a super rider on it. You're not a super rider. Please go switch another vehicle. Please, sir. Oh, man. I didn't get a chance to use all my light extras that I wanted to use on certain scenes. I had it all planned out. Well, the rules are the rules, sir. So go ahead and, uh, and uh, get another vehicle. Got plenty down at the station. Pick one. Just not that one that says supervisor on it. Uh, we're working on a new, another paint job or one where other deputies will be able to drive where it doesn't say supervisor, but we haven't got it sent to the shop yet. Uh, I think I should keep it a supervisor. Make people want to, you know, work up to something, but okay. Um, I can't just use it for this patrol, for this shift. No, no, no. Why not? You're not a super. You're not a supervisor. You can't. I could be acting supervisor for this shift. No. I and mean, I got if a real big like appetite. If, 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 if you like me to call the, if you like me to call the sheriff, I'll do that. Oh no, I'm good, bro. So you can, I, so I'm you good. Can nah, I'm good. Him, so uh, you I'm can good. ask him. Oh, okay, yeah. If you can do that, I, I ask him. I got a problem. Ask him. I mean, you're a supervisor. I don't know why you can't authorize that. Well, I'm not authorizing it. I'm telling you no. I'm saying you're a supervisor. I don't know why you can't authorize it, but if you can call the sheriff, I can ask the sheriff. So if you want to wake the sheriff up at this time of night, then you go ahead. I'm not going to call him. You call him. Okay. All right. Hey, how you doing? This is uh, Deputy Paul White. I just want to, real quick, just want to know if I can uh, operate this uh, new supervisor vehicle for today's patrol. Uh, yeah, for my shift for tonight. Ah, you reached a uh, voicemail of uh, uh, Christian Smith. The hell I did. The hell I did. available to take your call at this time. <laughs> So please leave your name and number and I'll get back to you uh, at the appropriate time. All right. Okay, so he's, okay, 
Chub, you got it. Well, I was talking to the lieutenant over here, but you got it. I'll let him know. All right. Thank you, sir. Okay. All right. He said I'm good to go. I highly doubt that. But okay. All right. If you said that. No, nah, he didn't say that. I'm going to turn it in because I want to get in trouble. I'm trying to get a raise, a promotion. One tango one. One tango one. Show me 10-7, 97 to Sandy. Swapping our vehicles again. Any unit in the area of Sandy Shores respond to a active shooter call uh, at the uh, Sandy Shores Motel. All units select oh, tech eight respond urgent. One take of one, you can reduce the response time. I'm about uh, twenty three so far, no uh, suspicious activity. Time four, one day one's gonna be in the area as well. One day one, you can go ahead and continue maybe two to three units uh, until we search so we can search the perimeter one take a one take a one can we get units to set up a perimeter around the uh hotel oh shit 10 13s 10 13s 10 13s oh shit I, I, I got a guy running at my vehicle with shooting. Tempo. Let's set the guy. I don't know if there's any more in the area. I got another. Oh, is that a. We got an officer over here? Yeah, Tempo. I'm okay, on foot. Copy. I see it. I see it. One down. I got one down. I don't know if we got any more. We got any uh, officers on, on uh, duty with the uh, drone certification? Negative. Not at this time. Copy. All right, we'll go ahead and uh, get his weapon from him. I got one taken off on foot, heading near 276. He's going to be, uh, looks like he's going to be uh, on Joshua man. Road. You got a description? Uh, looks like he's going to be heading towards um, the Sandy Airport. No description. Um, just got a subject running. Can't get the description right now. Is it related or he's running from the gunfire? No, nah, it's it's actually related. He was on scene at the motel. He's going to be on a dirt road parallel to Joshua Road. Can I get units en route to that location? Copy. One take a one. You can show me uh, 97. Gonna be crossing over the railroad tracks. You still got eyes on him? Ten four, he's gonna be heading near the airfield. <laughs> That's what I'm about to do, call an Uber. We're gonna be near three sixty four, he's gonna be in an, on the grounds of the prison. Copy. Yeah, I'm going to call the Uber. Yeah, we're going to call the Uber to uh, get us to where the uh, suspect at because uh, we don't have no vehicle. We'll probably never catch up on foot. So our uh, Uber ride is coming. I hope they don't kill us. Near 367. Where can I take it? Uh, let's see where he's at. Got her at gunpoint. It's going to be uh, actually a female that's actually on steroids. <laughs> Copy. I want to know if you could call we have one at gunpoint. For, uh, can we? Hold down to your butt. Yeah, make him speed up. I wonder if you could call an Uber for uh, 
a prisoner transport. Like if you could get in a car with the prisoner, like if you put a prisoner in the Uber vehicle and you get in there as well, like and you say like I have one ten fifteen at this the, time uh, we go ahead and lift the air. Um and uh, start to being thirty two fifty station. If you can still, you know, transfer transport them there like that way. Copy. That'd be a uh, nice kind of test out, try out to see. I don't know how good this Uber, how close they're going to be able to get us there. Seemed very impatient, though, I will say that. One take of one. One take of one. Be advised, uh, I took an Uber on scene. Ten four. All right. Good work. All right. Good work. Well, that was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, all the way to hell over here. Yeah, I'm about to call an Uber to get to uh, Sandy. I'm not going to wait. Okay, well you do that. Yeah, I'm not walking back. I am not walking back. It's a long way to go. But it's dirty. Yeah, I know we don't drive uh, dirty vehicles. That's the guy that's been crashing. What the hell is that, though? Why they just stopped over here? Oh, that bastard gonna use the damn charger. Oh man, what a... Boy, I tell you, he gonna tell me I can't use it. He wanna, he wanna use it. I could have used it. And Paul White don't have no, uh, he don't have no rank or nothing like that. So he trying to get that promotion. He gonna have to uh, follow the rules and adhere to what uh, his superiors uh, tell him.